Hello everybody, welcome back to Sawyer Live. Today we're trying out some Sort the Court. I know I'm definitely not the first one to play this game. This is also another older title, just like, uh, uh, just like there is no game. And this one I did actually see uh, Markiplier play way back when, but it's been a while and I'm, as far as I know, this game is somewhat infinitely generating, more or less, so, you know, it's not like we're gonna have the same thing happen. Hey, what's up? My lord, I'll help you rule your kingdom, but you have to make the tough choices. Just say yes or no, understand? I'm gonna say no. I don't know what I'm doing. Just give people their answers, okay? <laughs> Our city's still very small right now, but it certainly has the potential to grow. Perhaps one day we will have a bustling metropolis and you'll be invited to join the Council of Crowns. For now, all you need to concern yourself with is keeping your citizens happy and growing and growing our population. Do your best, sir. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? <laughs> I'm not super busy. Hello, sir. Are you looking for experienced barbers in your court? I'm going to say yes. Look at what I'm dealing with right now. <laughs> then I shall join you. I am the best of the best. Yeah, so this is this is the game. <laughs> Oh, I'm hungry. Can I eat some of your folks? I've got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. I'm going to I'm going to go no. I do know that Markiplier went the Chester route. I'm going to he's not allowed in my kingdom. <laughs> That's how we're playing this. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yeah, what's up you? Aha, I will bring you details soon. Weird uh Weird that you made a journey out to see me, <laughs> just to tell me that. Bonjour, my name is Madame Abel, and I've come to join your court. Will you have me? I mean, yeah, yeah, right? How sweet, I'm sure many wonderful adventures await us. Why not? <laughs> I don't, yeah, I guess, we're, we're doing well. I didn't get any cash out of that, but you know. That's, uh, I don't like feeding my people to animate chests. You feeling spooky today? A little bit. You are in my court. Heck yeah! Let the blood flow! <laughs> okay, I'm not sure how I feel. I'm definitely feeling spooky now. <laughs> hey, now here's the deal for you, pal. Give me some of your people's happiness. I'll hook you up with some gold. Sound good? Listen, Georgie. I'm gonna say no. I don't want to sacrifice people's happiness for money. Eh, I'll get you next time, buddy. Don't call me buddy. I'm really not. We don't have that kind of relationship. Hey, some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome? Absolutely. Get them in here. We could use some people. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, let's get some. Let's get some more people in the town. I could. We could go for more people. Eh, I was considering opening a soup shop. Think it's a good idea. I need some gold. You know what? We can spare it. People like soup. Very well, I'll sell my soup in the town square. I'm sure that's gonna go over swell. I could go for a... I could go for a tasty chicken broth right now. We've captured some foes on the battlefield. Shall we bring them home and put them to work? Uh... I feel like that's gonna go poorly for our happiness. I'm gonna say no. Let them, let them do whatever they feel like. We need to do something with them. Shall we ransom the captured foes off for a bit of gold? That I'm okay with, I think. I think I'm okay with that. Let's <laughs> let's do that. Very well. Better to have the gold than hostile captives. Absolutely. That's 100% what I'm thinking. Citizens are upset about whether or not ransoming our prisoners was the right choice. There's been some unrest about the decision. Hey, look, when you're king, we're still doing all right. People are happy the city is growing. That, yeah, I mean, come on. Like, uh, let me let me be a little honest right now. I'm not super into chicken soup. I don't like wet, floaty chicken. That's just, that's my hot take for the day. I like chicken broth, not not chicken soup. I drink, I'll take top ramen, but that's about as close as I get. I prefer chicken broth. The people have started a petition to ban pineapples in the city. <sighs> no. <laughs> I don't care if they're unhappy. I don't care if they're unhappy. Bring me the finest pizzas. You know what they'll have on them. Hey, now here's a deal for you, pal. Give me some of your people's happiness. I'll hook you up with some gold. Sound good? I'm going to be honest. I'm starting to consider it more and more. My people's happiness sucks. <laughs> but I still want to be the better king about it. I'm going to be the bigger king. 
ban pineapples? <laughs> Working conditions for us are unsafe. Will you please spend some gold on improving our ability to work? Oh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. 100%. Thanks, the builders appreciate this. I, I hope they do. Don't unionize, please. That'd be swell for me. Plants are interesting, don't you think? I would love to open a garden. May I have some workers help me? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, thank you. I'll send some I'll send them back as soon as they're done. Yeah, go for it. We could use a, we could use some gardening around here. <laughs> Let's get into some gardening. My lord, a man wishes to settle a dispute. He says he is way cool, but his friend says he is not. Do you think he's cool? I mean, yeah. Like, why not, right? Is is there something I don't know? <laughs> what about people are people are happy city is growing. What why wouldn't he be cool? I, I I spoke to his mother. His mother agreed that he is cool. The caravan of mine wishes to camp in your city for the next few days. Might that be arranged? Absolutely. Come get some soup. Quite agreeable. We shall work together again, I hope. Yeah, get your soup on. Get the soup in the caravan. Uh, hey, uh, you think you could tell people to stop calling me slime ball? It's hurting my feelings. Yeah, why are they? Yeah, knock it off, guys. Thanks, boss. I gave him a snake thing instead of a slime thing. That, I don't know if that's offensive or not. Squee! There's a mouse. Should we chase it away? I feel like yes. Mm -hmm. Squee! Woo, it's gone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I imagine that was going to lead into something later. My lord, I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. Ah, yeah, go for it. For the kingdom, I shall return to you, my lord. Aw. You. Such a sweetheart. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. Absolutely not. Get out of here. Get out of my court. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. Yeah! I built this high road. <laughs> the Sultan's caravan is resting in town. Our citizens have been trading with them, producing a small amount of tax income. Fantastic. <laughs> Things are going well. Yeah, we're 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 on the up and up right now. We're in the top ten uh, villages under twenty. I've got a bit. Uh, Villages under 200. There we go. That's I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Are you gonna tell me about it this time? Of course you're not. What am I agreeing to with you, Sultan? I trust you right now. Little Fang, I'm the Duke of Spook. You want a spook ni spooky nickname? Absolutely, yes. Give me a spooky nickname. You can be the Creep King. <laughs> Absolutely. Assign me a plaque. <laughs> the spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know, a sp I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. Here's the thing. Even dead people count as citizens, in my opinion. 200? Absolutely not anyway. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. Don't bother. <laughs> I'm a blacksmith, and I'd like to set up shop here. I can pay my own way. I just need your permission. What do you say? Go for it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, yes. I'll show you my incredible skill. Just you wait. I believe in you, man. You got a sweet looking tat on your arm. You ever see a treasure chest do a backflip? I know where this is going because I lost a bet once on this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm so dismissive of Chester. <laughs> The Sultan's caravan is resting in town. Yeah, we're getting more tax income. That's pretty chill. Yep, up and up. Oh, look at our look at our little village out there. Duke of Spook, you want a spooky nickname? Of course I do. What's the spooky nickname of the day? Duke of Spook? Oh, it's still the Creep King. Give me a second plaque. <laughs> give me another plaque with it. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? I'll give it a try. Whoa! Hey! All right, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. Certainly did. Ah, oh, that was that was good. An offer for you, friend. I would purchase a shipment of luxury goods from you for a fair price. Yeah, I. Oh, oh! He took it from my people. That's how it worked. Whoopsie daisies. Hmm. Hey, hello, Sonny. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? Absolutely, yeah. Can I get the funnies for you? 
Or can I, can I get the funnies? I, I wouldn't mind reading the funnies, seeing what this town considers funny. Georgie, <laughs> hey, uh, good friend, I thought you might be interested in making a deal, a good, wholesome, friendly deal. Yeah, an angel such as myself could offer you lots of happiness. It would cost you some gold, though. Um, a few hundred gold from you and I'll make sure your citizens are happy. I, I have to say no. What's a guy got to do to make a deal around here? I have to say no. He's a freaking devil. <laughs> Sultan's caravan has left town as a gesture of goodwill. They have left behind a small pouch of gold. Just like in town square or do you drop it off? I didn't see him. <laughs> We're, d we're doing okay. Uh, I would like some money, please. I'm gonna say yes, because I'm worried what you'll do if I don't. Thank you for the money, good sir. This is good money. Yeah, it is. You took a hundred gold? Are you kidding me? My lord, I have returned. Did you did you kill the Yedu on the way in? I am ashamed to inform you that I return with nothing. Shall I show you myself to... Oh, what? No, no, don't go to the dungeons. You forgive me, oh kind and gracious lord? Bless you! Maybe don't get ahead of ourselves on that one, but, <laughs> you know, I'd, I'm i not super peeved at you, I'll tell you that. He's got a shiny coin, yes he does. Mm -hmm. Yes he does! Oh, he has five shiny coins. Ook ook indeed! Ook ook kachu! Hey, it's the blacksmith! Would you like to purchase any swords for your guards? A well-protected city is a happy city. I'm willing to bet it is. For 20 gold? This place is a steal. My goodness, you gotta... How do I give you a tip in this game? <laughs> you gotta, you gotta appreciate your artwork more. I'm not, I'm not charging you for exposure here. I'm the Duke of Spook. You want a spooky nickname? Of course I do. You can be Thrice the Creep King. Thrice the Creep King. Thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> I'm gonna we're gonna pause here for just a minute. I'm gonna come back to this because I am enjoying this I feel like I'm doing decently. I got a lot of money and some people <laughs> So we'll play a little bit more of this soon. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of your day